<laughs> we're off again. <laughs> Good morning, everybody. I'm David. And I'm Shane. And we are the Narrowboat Project, just in case you didn't know. <laughs> if you are new here, welcome. Um, please do subscribe if you are new. And if you're not subscribed, please subscribe. How many times can you say subscribe in subscribe, subscribe, five so seconds? I can't say it <laughs> <laughs> Just before we go on with uh, today's video, we've got a big thank you to say, haven't we? We have. The lovely Matt L. Hi, Matt. Supported us over on Kofi by buying us some coffees. Um, he really loved our videos, which is really sweet, and just yeah. wanted to show some appreciation because it does cost to make the videos. Um, we have to drive somewhere. Or we have to. David spends a lot of time editing all my bloopers. Um, <laughs> <laughs> so yeah. it's really lovely that, that Matt wanted to um, support us. So if you'd like to do the same, we'll leave the link down below. Um, that's just, yes. yeah, it's just lovely, isn't it? It's yeah. nice to be able to get paid for something you love doing. Yeah. <laughs> and thank you to anybody who supports the channel. It's uh, much appreciated. Mm -hmm. We love doing this and we love trying to sort of help people along with the lifestyle as well. So uh, thank you. <laughs> anyway, um, today's video, you've probably seen the title. Mortgage free and off grid for 35k. What does that mean? Well, we're going to show you a little boat today. Um, it's around that price mark and uh, it's a little 45 foot. Um, not quite sure, mate. Did you get the print out? I have, it's inside. Oh, okay, we'll, we'll, go we'll show you more the anyway. In a minute. Yeah, so um, let's get on and do the boat tour. Okay, so as we said, the boat's 45 foot long. It's called The Show Must Go On. It's a reverse layout, which is the dream. Um, everybody wants a reverse layout. Um. <laughs> I'm just showing them the name, sorry. <laughs> keep going. Keep going, keep going. Now this one's actually got a pram cover, which is pretty good, because they're quite expensive if, they, if you need to get one in. So having one already on a boat that you buy is brilliant. Um, and David's about to turn around and walk onto the yeah, boat. Yeah, I just he want falls to point off. out there's some solar already on the roof there. So oh, there is. If, so that uh, helps with the whole off grid. Off grid thing. I'm not sure the power will check that out in a minute. But uh, <laughs> yeah, let's go in and have a look, shall we? Okay. Okay. I'll follow you in. Okay. Come on in. So it's a cruiser stern. Yeah, which means you've got the space. This yeah. guy's adapted the, um, what do you call it, throttle? Yeah, yeah. yeah. Um, so he doesn't got bent down, which I think is brilliant. Yeah. Because <laughs> you're on your you're on your tiller here. Yeah. And then you've got to like right. Oh yeah, that's just very sensible. Yeah, it's pretty good. And lots of room in the back, and obviously it's got yeah. the uh, the cover as well, which is very handy dandy. Yes. So. Uh, handy dandy. Let's, let's, let's head on, come in. on in. So um, this guy was obviously a, a who supporter. Notts County. <laughs> in fact, I'll just pull the. You can just see there, he's got the Knotts County logo on the... Uh, and you'll see the, little magpies everywhere as we go through the boat. But once yeah. the boat's yours, you can really personalise it to your taste. Absolutely. Obviously, if you're not yeah. a supporter, then you'll want to get rid of everything, maybe. Yeah. But then you have the fun of making it all your own, yeah. which is really nice. <laughs> okay. Um, Worth pointing out, it's actually a reverse layout, isn't it? I said kind that of. already. Oh, did you? I Very did. Well, you weren't listening, were you, darling? Well, no. Goodness me. <laughs> <laughs> All right, let me head yeah, down. Yeah, come on in. I'm just looking where everything is here at the moment. Ah, I found okay. the Victron. So okay. we've got an inverter set up already. Right. Let's show them that. Oh, yeah. 1600 Victron. I always struggle to say this word. Eber spatcher. Eber yeah. yeah, yeah. There's the little switchy for that. Yeah. Electric. I'll tell you what. Let me come past you. And I'll turn round and point at you that way. Excuse me, folks. While we manoeuvre, we do the narrowboat <laughs> shuffle. <laughs> We've got the um, electrics are in there. All the on and offy switches at the back there. Yeah. Got your radio frontage. Yeah. It's quite often when you look round boats, you open a cupboard and you'll find all the paperwork in there. Yes. Spare keys, locks, all yeah, sorts of things. Yeah, they can be all over the place. Yeah. So we've got a dual stove heater in here. Yeah. Um, we've got a little L-shaped sofa there. Yep. That's all fixed in. So there's no extra bedding this this end, um, unless you're very little <laughs> and, can, and can get on there. Yeah. Um, so keep going back, keep going back. The kitchen is actually a really nice big area. So, you've obviously got the hob and the stove, 
lots of storage, loads of storage under here, a bit of storage there, there's a microwave, and you've got a little flip up table there. Very handy, a little breakfast table. Yeah, which is. To nice. eat your rice krispies at. Eat your rice. We bought some rice krispies the other day, we haven't had them for years, <laughs> they did. were so nice. Yeah. <laughs> You step there and I'll step past mm. this way so I oh, can we're give doing, them we're a, shuffling again. We're doing, we're doing a little shuffle. Oh. I'll just show you the front again before I turn around. Here we go. And let's look into the uh, middle of the boat, into the kitchen. Yeah. So all the, all the cupboards are good. There's no kind of musty smell nasty or anything smells, in there. They're yeah. just nice and dry. Oh, there's a safe in there as well. Okay. Um, Fridge with a separate <laughs> freezer by the looks of it. Yeah, the big freezer. <laughs> yeah. I really want one of those. We've got like an ice box. We get a small packet of chips and a packet of peas. <laughs> <laughs> so that's it. Microwave. <laughs> okay, going through to the to the loo. Okay, this might be all you. <laughs> okay. <laughs> There's not room for two in there. No, I mean he's currently got a porta potty in there. Mm. However, we did see outside, didn't we, that there was a yeah, a there's pump a pump out, out option. So we'd, oh, he went all dark. Oh, uh -oh. Um, so yeah, we'd have to check that out. But he's got his uh, <laughs> magpies, not county towels around the sink, and then the step in, step in shower. So and then and then we've got the. So this is a reverse layout, that means the bed is in the bow of the boat um, and you generally have an escape route in the bow um, which you've got the hatch here with some nice steps which is good. Uh, so there's storage under the bed. Yep, it's got a little drop down um, cupboard there as well where your, where your leg is with some drawers. Yeah, yeah like a there. little dressing table yeah. and a wardrobe. Yep. So for a 45 foot boat, I think that's quite a nice, that's quite a nice layout on my dark. You are a little bit dark. Can you Hello. see me? <laughs> Let's step back. But yeah, but it does have a, a like a full cross, cross bed, which is... Yeah, looks massive. Which is pretty nice, isn't it? Yeah, yeah. Like I say, everybody's dream list is to have a reverse layout, so yeah. you don't walk straight down from the outside into your bedroom. Um, I'll walk backwards. This is an art in itself. <laughs> Just going backwards through the boat. So when you come to look at boats, you get um, a printout. And it has all sorts of information on it. So this boat is a 2001 okay. 45 foot cruiser stern. Yep. Um, it started life as a hire boat, apparently. That's interesting. Uh, so I'm just having a little read through. The engine yep. is a Beta Marine. What's the horsepower on that? Uh, so. Horsepower is. I've got an engine model. Is that the same thing? No. No. Oh, there we go. Thirty-three, which so, is quite good for a little boat, isn't it? Thirty-three horsepower Beta Marine engine. Yeah. So okay. that's good. Yep. Um, the hull is ten by six by four. Yep. That's with regards to the mill of steel, by the way. Yes, the hub. Whenever you get a boat, you need to get a survey. Always get a survey and get that checked out. Um, heard some horror stories about that. <laughs> Do you want to give them the current price and where it's lying? The current price is 34950 As with everything, you can always put in an offer. Um, it's a good place to kind of start a conversation about something. Yep. <laughs> and hopefully you can both agree on a good amount where everyone's happy. Yeah. Um, it's at Mercia Marina. They've got loads of other boats here as well. I think this is the cheapest they've got here at the moment. Um, so we're kind of showing you the options for different budgets to give you an idea of what you can expect for a, a 34,950 yeah. boat. Perhaps if, because obviously we, we started out with a flat, yes. which had some equity in it. We did. And, and that's kind of how we... Uh, got to afford the boat so yeah if you're thinking of selling and you've got some equity in your house and this is the amount the, the budget that you're looking at this mm. is the uh, just to give you an idea on the type of boat that you could get for 35k for basically. that money yeah and uh, yeah. it's with new and used isn't it at it mercy is. and marina the new and used boat company at mercy and marina they've got brokerages in different marinas um, i think four in total yeah um and 
a whole range of boat from brand new to second hand. Yeah. Um, so they're a great, great company to come and have a chat with. Yeah. Um, and have a look online. Can I find them online? Yeah. Should we have a look at the engine? You can use Boat Co, isn't it? <laughs> yeah. So let's, uh, well, we'll definitely show them the outside. I'm not sure about lifting the engine boards today. Ah. It's a bit chilly. <laughs> <laughs> But uh, we'll head outside and show them the uh, the outside, I think. Okay, so. okay. let's do that. Um, steps up to the to the stern. Oh, Some little handy dandy storage here. Oh yeah, that, that yeah table. that will go just here where the um, yeah, yeah there you go. It goes in there. Yeah, it's got a rad here, so obviously to do with the MS back. In fact, there's four rads through the boat. Oh my God, that would be toasty and a fire. Yeah, cool. I think the one down in the bedroom is is an electric one. I'm not sure, and the others are. Okay. Oh no, no, it has got a pipe yeah, down yeah. to it. I'm wrong. Yeah. I'm wrong. Forget that. But yeah, four four reds on a little forty five four. It's going to be toasty, isn't You'd it? You'd be warm. Yeah. <laughs> anyway, TV, and um, steps up into the into the stern. Like I said, it is a cruiser, so lots of room back here, and uh, big old chunky tiller and a little seat, which I'm going to have a seat on. And uh, that's the view into the bow. Let's have a little wander outside and have another look. So there she is. It's black and yellow, or black and kind of yellow. And uh, maybe not to not to everybody's taste, but you can you know, for a boat of this price, you get what you get, and you make of it what you want really. Um, Here's the bow. Interesting Phoenix graphic there. Did you see that? No. Oh, a little, a little Phoenix. Now, obviously, there's no, there's no doors into the oh, yeah. boat here because it's a fixed bed. Yes. Uh, full width fixed bed. So the only a entrance and exit is at the, uh, is at the stern on this or one. Or through the hatch if you're in an emergency. Or through the hatch, yeah. Did you want to talk about being off grid a little bit more? Yeah, I can do. The um, I'm not sure the power on this, but there are two solar panels on the roof. Um, and again, I'd have to check what the batteries are. But for a nice little sort of off-grid setup, I think that's a very, very good start. Uh, Lithium batteries are probably something that you'd want to put in. Yeah, at some we point, love aren't our they? lithium batteries. Complete game changer. Yeah. But, uh, but yeah, there you go. The show must go on. <laughs> and, uh, so, what's, where are we? We're mid October, aren't we? So yeah. This is available at Mercy Marina at yeah. the moment. Um, if you wanted to come down and have a look, give the guys in the office a call. Yep. Well, again, we'll link their website down Tell them you down saw the below, video. Shall we? <laughs> and. Uh, That'll make them really happy. It'll make us happy too. Yeah. But yeah, if this is something that you're interested in, around 35k, mm. um, do come and have a look at it because I think it has potential. It, it does need bits doing, like any boat would do at 35k. But I think as a, a boat to get you mortgage free and off grid. And on the water. On the water, it's. Uh, Having fun. Yeah. It's a nice little boat to get started. Isn't it? It is. Mm. Very good, very good. And um, even better if you're not a county fan. <laughs> if you're not, then you need to get the paint uh, the paint jar out quite soon, I think. But uh, there we go. Hope that's helped. Um, but yeah, come and have a look at it and uh, see what you think. Uh, but it does have everything. Abyssbaka heater, the solar, nice cruiser stern. And the um, lovely cover there, all that kind of stuff. So yeah, come and have a look at it. So there we have it. There's our 34 950 boat um, in all its glory. Um, we've just had a look through all the other boats as well. They've got some brand new ones here for 200,000 and it's wide beams and they've just got the whole range. Um, so thanks for watching. Um, don't forget to subscribe and we'll see you next time. Bye. Bye.